Today I'm going to be um, telling you about a game called Bedlam. See? Okay. Now. How do you play it? Um, first of all, you, um, so when you get a card and you get these, that means you can go forward ones. Well, any card, whatever card you're on, that means what card you, what card you get, you get to move forward ones. If you get two or three or more, you get to move that number. You get to go three or four, okay. And you and have to go all the way up here, get your thing, go all the way back. So, will you show us what it's like when you get you get your thing? Huh? Put it up there and put the little, little cap on it so people can see. So you get all the way over here, and then you have to go all the way. And the first one back? It's a winner. Okay. Also, um, next. Okay. Um, and how, um, how many people can play? Eight. Okay. And is it for kids, adults, or both? Um, it's for both, because me and Daddy played one game, or two, or three, or four. Mm-hmm. Four. Played four games? And it, but you played it with other people too, right? Yeah, yeah. You played it with four people, our whole family, and then what? Okay. Um, what parts of the game make it good to play? None. None? What? I know it says it here. Mom voted Bedlam. Best family game. Mm -hmm. It's not the best family game. No? But it's like the top five, right? It, it could be if... Someone improved it. Yeah. But, yeah. But it's not. What what, what? 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 What's? What? What's wrong with the game? Well, um, chaotic shouting game. And. What do you mean? Um. Okay, it what? Says on this card. It says right there. The chaotic in front of this. Uh huh. Best family game, the chaotic. But you like shouting and you like being in chaos, don't you? Yeah. So, um, if you want to play this, you'll have to be someone who actually likes shouting at people. Yeah. Yeah, like you. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Alright. So, what you're saying is that. It causes lots of arguments? Yeah, a lot. How many times have we played this game? Four, and all of those four arguments. Arguments every time? These ones that I'm doing are arguments. <laughs> and these are the four times we've played them. Uh-huh. Mm. Every single time we leave angry, nobody's happy, huh? Yeah. It's pretty much the angry... Even the last time, especially the last time. Why, why the last time? Because it's wiggling super fast. Yeah. <laughs> what went wrong the last time? Um, you tricked me and I tricked you at the same time and we both lost. Mm. You won that one. <laughs> that was pretty bad. Also, even, there's a timer in it. Yeah. Even Mummy hated me after that one. Yeah. Um, how do you think it could be improved? What, all of the game? Or yeah. just... Uh, um... All of it because one this I think there that should be X X no timer yeah. yeah because well that's basically what makes the chaotic thing mm -hmm. um also because you have to swap with people you have to swap cards. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that's another reason. And people can, like, not tell the truth about the cards you're swapping, huh? Yeah, by the time you tricked me. <laughs> I tricked you. <laughs> anyway. Alright, is, is there anything else people should know when they're thinking about buying this game?
What? Before they buy this game, they should look here first. Yeah. And think about whether they really want chaos and shouting and anger and yeah. hate and meanness. You know, I might actually donate it. Yeah? Yeah. We got it as a donation, and we'll probably just give it back. There's a fireplace right behind you. I've been thinking about just throwing it into that, too. Mm. Nobody would be mad about that. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I guess that's about it. Any last words to say? Bye.